Hello friends, welcome back again in our Excel automation tool. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show a complete dynamic data entry tool with a multiple data entry sheet. And there you can see this is our multiple data entry sheet. There is tasking, department and research. So if you want to control at the same time, just I'm just opening the launch form. And there you can see this is the category. That means this is the database sheet name and the sheet name is tasking, department and research okay so if i want to store data into the tasking sheet just click the tasking and there is record which is dynamically maintained and there is status which is drop down and finding in progress and complete is status so i am selecting one and there is entry date so you can set from the calendar button and i am just selecting that one and there is subject so if you want to input like test basis any data last description and the next thing is poc that is also our record field okay so there you can see this is our button and also this is our add new update and delete and the clear so also as usual you can see this is add new button is enable but update and delete one is not enable now so we just now add information into the tasking sheet so i am just add so do you want to add save data okay i am just store data into the task sheet if i want to check then you can see this is our new data is available there okay i want to reopen this and now i want to store into the another sheet like department okay and this is also the dynamically changeable and there is also this is the next status and entry date okay i'm selecting that one okay okay so i am just add new again okay i am going to the department and there is new data is available there so you can see this is research and depth and tasking and i am going to open the form and all our data showing at the same time so now we are going to show how we can use the search criteria wise if you want to show all data at the same time just click the all and click the search button data will be show in the list box i am just want to show as for tasking sheet wise so i am clicking the tasking and click the search button okay also i want to subject as per wise test so i can select subject and just type test okay that means all our criteria wise data will be show and you can see available there i am just refresh for the reform and at this moment i want to just add edit anything so how we can update or delete anything like if you want to edit anything like double click there and this is department sheet data and just i am going to change the status just pending to complete i am changing the status and there is you can see update and delete button is now available so you can use it but you cannot add anything information now until refresh button click so just update button and do you want to update data yes so you can see all our data is refreshing in the list box sheet and data will be available also there so the status is changed and then it is completed okay i am also want to the delete from the task sheet just double click there and i am click the delete button okay do you want to delete and delete so data will be deleted from the tasking sheet so now there is only one that is available and there is also and research also the only one available data so reopen the form and there you can see this is all there is only three data available there so clear button is for clear all the input fields okay and there is also the download button that means if you want to download all information from the list box just click the download button and data will be stored to the your local storage just open the downloaded sheet and this is also all data available there that means tasking department and research all data available there okay i am close this and you open this form and there is exit button for close the form i am just exit do you want to leave okay i am leaving the user from just yes the user from is closed now 
so you need to know uh, this is our download platform and there is all our automation tool available there and day by day we will be updated there and also please subscribe to our channel please and as a result you can buy me a coffee that's all thank you very much see you in the next tutorial